cubs are raised by a dog. They were born at the Cincinnati Zoo, but their mother couldn't take care of them, so the staff took over their care, and now their part-time nanny, Blakely the Australian Shepherd, stepped in to help. She's a common companion to animals who need a little extra TLC or wrestling advice. She's helped baby cheetahs, wallabies, skunks, and many others. She looks like a very patient dog. Not all dogs. She's going to bite that tail. And if you love cats, then you'll want to find some time to check this out. Or not, if you don't like cats. It's the International <laughs> Cat Exhibition in St. Petersburg, Russia. They showcase some pretty rare breeds, including Russia Blue, Scottish Fold, British Short Hair, and Cornish Tex. The most expensive animal goes for 1.4 million rubles. Ooh. That is just under 24,000 US dollars. Russian media says Russia is among the countries with the highest proportion of raising cats, claiming that one third of Russian households include at least one cat. That's a beautiful cat, that little cat right there. I didn't know there were so many breeds of cats. I thought it was just cats. You obviously are not a cat person. <laughs> I'm not lover. a cat person. I'm allergic <laughs> to cats, so I'm not a cat person. So that would not be a destination location. No, I would be, my allergies would be out of control right. in Russia. Well, we're going to sign off today. This is my final show. I am going to be leaving on maternity leave. I'm expecting at the end of May, early June. You're kidding. But, yes, I know. Again, I not no just idea. cupcakes. Um, but I am going to need a little time here to prepare. Right. And uh, it's been great working with you. And look forward to working with you again. So much fun working with you. And we'll see you all again. That's our show this morning. Thanks so much for watching.